Hi guys! I have a workout room. I can't believe it. I just never imagined myself with a workout room. I don't know if I, I always thought I'd be too poor or something. I don't know. Anyway, it is October and winter is coming. And so is the cold and the snow. If you're somewhere like Texas or Florida or California and it's just sunny every day and it's still in the 70s, good for you. I'm happy for you. But that is not the case where I am. I am in a place called Wisconsin. And here it is cold 100% of the time in November through April. And it snows. My husband and I had an empty room downstairs that we weren't using. You know, when there's a snowstorm outside, which happens a lot in Wisconsin, it's really nice to just work out at home. I can't believe how affordable it was to create this room. I'm just, I'm very excited about it. We've had both exercise machines for, I think, three days now. And so far, we have done exercise every single day. So we got three days down and a whole winter to go. Let's see how in shape we can get. I'm gonna go ahead and head to the workout room. I hope you guys like it. I do. So let's do it. Should I show, Hello. Should I show everyone in the workout room? Be my guest. All right, here we go. All right, guys, this is it. The drywall is missing right there. There were actually cabinets built in down here that we took out. These are the mirrors. These black mirrors are from Walmart. They were $5 each. I looked into getting workout room mirrors and they are so expensive. So I was like, no. Nope, I'm getting $5 Walmart mirrors. So I think they look really nice. And here is our treadmill. We got this from Amazon. It was only about $400, I believe, around there. Xterra is the brand name. We really like it so far. So I'll link it down below if you're interested. You can jog and run on there pretty fast. My husband wanted it to go up to 10 miles per hour because he runs pretty fast on there. I go just as fast as he does, if not faster on the treadmill. So um, yeah, I he can't really keep up with me most of the time. <laughs> I'm kidding. And this is my elliptical. This was 50 bucks. I found this on Facebook Marketplace and what a steal. If you're wondering what this window is here, it's called an egress window. There's actually some like ladder built in. That's outside right there. If a fire starts while you're working out, you can just get some more calories in and climb those ladders to the outside. This is the elliptical. You can see it from this angle. I really like it. And here is the treadmill from this angle. You can kind of see where I walked in. Right now I have nature playing on the TV. I really like having that on the TV while I'm working out because it makes me feel like I'm outside. Just peaceful and nice. See, look at those trees. How nice is that? That is a smart TV from Walmart. It was $115. Just some shelves over here. I have my weights. I use those and I also use my workout mat right here. That's from Walmart. Got a fan there. Two fans in here. The more fans, the better. That's what I say. We love it in here. It's so perfect. I definitely hope it keeps us motivated during the winter. It's so convenient to have this at our house and I'm so happy that we can use this room for something. I could stand like that. It makes them look like they're thin, like I have long legs. It's delusional. Hey Google, play some top hits. Okay, here's the Spotify playlist called Today's yeah. Top Hits. Yeah. Sorry, something went wrong. What? Ready, give it another try. Screw you, Google. Hey Google. Hey YouTube. Uh, hey. <laughs> hey Google. Am I gonna be in shape because of this workout room? Sorry, I don't have any information about that. Oh, well thanks anyway. Hey Google, do you like my outfit? You look great. Don't be oh. so hard on yourself. Oh. It would help to know how satisfied you are with my response. I am 100%. Oh. If one's the worst and five's the best. Well, who's gonna be upset with that answer? I mean, I'm gonna go with a five. Five. Sorry, I don't understand. Oh, uh, five. Five? I'll rate it as a five, Google.
Another thing I love is that if I need to walk for 10 minutes because I just need to clear my head or I only have 10 minutes or I don't want to get super sweaty, I can just come down here and I can just walk for 10 minutes, get my heart rate up a little bit and feel a little better. Just trying to get my mouse in. Yeah. All right, Jared, I just wanted to get you in here because you're also the one that has this workout room. Would you say that this, you really Bye. like? <laughs> so, would you say you really like having this workout room? Say that again. Would you say you really, would you say you really like having this workout room? Yes, I like having this workout room. Do you feel like it'll help you become more fit and stay active during the winter? Yes, indeed. Do you think it was worth the money? Yeah, wasn't that much money. Alright, you're giving me very short answers, but I would like a little more in depth. <laughs> um, what was the first question, first part of the question? Do you enjoy having a workout room? And yes. why? I thoroughly enjoy having a workout room. I like to run outside, typically, but in the winter time. In the winter is what is what we really need this workout room yeah. for. We wanted to get it's at least winter. a treadmill last year, well, for last winter, but we didn't. Yeah, and we both gained weight. It wasn't just me. <laughs> have you ever farted while you're on the treadmill? Actually, I don't think I have yet. Cause really? It's brand new. Good job. I have. <laughs> Do you feel like Rudy's this workout pooping. room was worth the money and time that we got? Rudy pooped. And it was relatively oh, really? solid. That's our cat. He's having some diarrhea issues, but lately his poop has been more solid, so. Uh, anyway, back to the workout room. Would, what is your biggest tip for keeping people motivated to keep working out during the winter? Well, that's kind of my problem, because I'm not really motivated, so like going to a gym, I don't know, just having something that's easily accessible helps keep me motivated. Yeah, that's what I said. When there's a snowstorm, you don't have to try to get in your car and drive off and end up in the ditch. <laughs> like I That's have. That's just common. We both have done that. Yeah. If anyone has the same issue that I do where my leggings do not stay up, I actually have a trick where I put elastic in the waistband and tighten it and then it stays up really well. So, and it takes like two minutes. Little tip for ya. Exercise makes me feel so much better. The endorphins are no joke. Our home gym only costs us about $550 and we're gonna have that for years and we're gonna have the exercise equipment probably even after we move out of this house. We don't have to go and get ready and pack our bag to go to the gym. Everything we have is in the room, all our equipment. We also don't have to wait for anyone to get off of exercise equipment that we want to use and we don't have to worry about the gym being packed. Not that that would be a problem right now with COVID. So anyway, to sum everything up, I'm just very excited about this workout room and I'm really hoping it helps me to stay fit during the winter because <laughs> last winter, um, let's just say I gained a few pounds. Let's just say that. 
it wasn't a few pounds, okay, it was more than a few. But it was because I didn't do anything. I wasn't active. And my husband and I love going for walks outside, but not during the winter. Not when you're gonna take one step and slip on the ice and break your leg. Okay, I don't think that would happen if I fell. I'm not 100 years old, but you know what I mean? Like, plus the wind blows in your face, negative 100 degrees. Having a gym at home is going to help both of us stay active, burn calories, feel good, look good. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I just want to say thank you to everyone who's been watching every single one of my videos so far. We'll see if this home exercise room is the key to my fitness success. Thank you guys. Bye.